the air vents have a tweaked look with a more complex design. The gear shift is different, too. In terms of upholstery, Audi is no longer offering Alcantara. Instead, the company is using Dynamica microfiber in places that require the faux suede touches. Lower trims of the Q2 have an analog instrument cluster, but higher grades use Audi's virtual cockpit digital instrument display. An 8.3-inch infotainment screen sits on top of the dashboard. Audi also makes its adaptive cruise assist system available on the Q2 when paired with MMI Navigation Plus, Virtual Cockpit, and the automatic gearbox. The tech is able to control the vehicle within a single lane on the road, include handling acceleration, braking, and steering inputs. Drivers just need to keep their hands on the capacitive steering wheel. The exterior of the Q2 is available in five new colors. Apple Green makes its debut in the Audi palette. There's also Arrow Gray, Manhattan Gray, Navarre Blue, and Turbo Blue. Depending on what buyers want, various equipment lines make the C-pillar's body color, black, gray, or silver. Similarly, the lower cladding is available in black, Manhattan Gray, or the body color. The designers have now applied the motif of the polygon, which already characterized the front and shoulder line, to the rear end as well. The bumper has an integrated diffuser insert with large five-sided polygons. The front has also been modified, with the surfaces below the headlights emerging in a more striking manner. The octagonal single frame is slightly lower, making the front section appear wider. Its insert also interprets the polygon motif. The advanced and S-line equipment lines feature narrow slits between the radiator grille and the hood that are reminiscent of the Audi Sport Quattro, an icon of the brand. The large implied air inlets also appear even more expressive, especially in the S-line. LED headlights now come as standard in the Audi Q2, and Matrix LED headlights are available as an option. Seven individual LEDs seated in a shared module produce an intelligently controlled high beam light. It always illuminates the road as brightly as possible without blinding other road users. Ten light-emitting diodes installed behind rhomboid optical components generate the daytime running light, while seven further LEDs generate the dynamic turn signal light in addition. The refreshed Audi Q2 debuts in Europe with a sharper look and new engine. The Four Rings begins taking orders for them in September and prices start at around €25,000 in Germany, $29,962 at current exchange rates. Thank you for watching and don't forget to like, subscribe and share this video. Subscribe to Auto TV.